Hi everyone, this is Shirley from Shirley's World, and I have a box to open. I got it today. Uh, Bumblebee sent me a box of goodies, and they're always good, and I'm excited to open this. I think she said this is a spring-summer box, and uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I'll wait till some people come in here. I hope this goes well because my computer has flashed a couple times, like went black for just a second and back on again. So I don't know what that's about. Also, I'm back down to just one label maker printer. My, that cheap ink that I bought, Hi, Bumblebee. That cheap ink that I bought, I'm having some trouble with the cartridges. Uh, it wouldn't print, and it reads, please replace, or please check cartridge, right, the right cartridge. So I checked it. I took it out. I don't know. looks the same to me. <laughs> and put it back in a couple times, and it still does that, and it won't print anything. So thank goodness I didn't throw the old ones away. So I put the old ones, which are real HP ones. They just are short of on ink. So I put them back in and then it printed, but it prints so light you can hardly, this is, it prints so light you can hardly see. But it works. So... I went back on Amazon and found another distributor that does this refilling of the inks. And these are, these are, the one I got didn't, you couldn't send it back. This one you can. Uh, it's free, uh, free shipping back. So if something happens to the next ones and they won't come till I think Sunday or maybe tomorrow, I don't know. So I'll try them because I am not paying a hundred and whatever it was, hundred and thirty, hundred and fifty dollars for ink cartridges from HP. Uh, yeah. So that was another headache that happened uh, this morning. I'm just maybe I'll just have to learn how to do the the label maker size the four by six ones for Mercari because Mercari is the problem and it doesn't matter if I print out these big sheets for me to to go by uh, I can I can just write it down but as far as the postage labels they have to be clear and able to be read so yeah there is a way to do the Mercari labels on the 4x6 uh, printers, but it's confusing. Uh, I'll have to go back and read about it again, I guess. <clears throat> In the meantime, I'm hoping I don't get any Mercari's. Got uh, two Poshmark sales so far today. I had a couple days where eBay seems to have just turned me off. It, 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 I swear, it goes like that. You'll be going along okay, not tremendous, but just okay. And then all of a sudden, it's like they s switched you off. I don't know. So I'm still, I'm doing some uh, listing new things now, along with some of the older things. So it should be. You know, fine. Oh, yeah, so let me. I can't wait to open this box. I didn't even move the blue tissue paper yet. So uh, let me pull this over closer. I have it up on a little bench. Oh, and now it's it's in another it's in a big plastic bag too. Okay. Hey. 
All right, let me uh, pick out this white, feels like denim, by Refuge. It's a little mini skirt. Or shorts. No, it's shorts. I'm sorry. <laughs> little white uh, mini shorts. Like booty shorts almost. They're just short shorts. White by Refuge. And they are a size eight. Oh, eight. That's a good size. So, yeah, I sell shorts. They're distressed here in a raw hem. Perfect. <clears throat> Next thing is a little, this is a little mini, mini dress, I think. Yes, a little mini dress. This is by Billabong in a medium. It's a little mini dress. Oh, it goes with my top here. <laughs> oh, it has buttons on the top, but it doesn't. I don't think it unbuttons, no. And elastic around the waist. I think it's just a pullover little dress. Straps. Cool summery sundress. Oh, these are these are. Oh, these are surf shorts, uh, board shorts, I think, by Speedo in a large. I haven't found any good board shorts. I looked at them last time when I was at Goodwill, and I still haven't found any good ones. Yeah, Speedo is good. good uh, brand, has pockets and has the tie. And a waist, uh, waist in a size large men's. There's the Speedo insignia. It's the netting inside. So these actually, with the netting inside, these are swim trunks. I don't think board shorts have the netting, and they usually don't have that type of a pocket. So these are just shorts. Um, uh, these are trunks, men's swimming trunks. Columbia. Oh, this is sleeveless, extra large. This is a women's uh, sleeveless beige shirt, button down shirt or button up. I guess they call it uh, by Columbia size extra large great for summer yeah, I think we have shoes here Oh, shoes with something in them. <laughs> I like the prizes you put in the shoes. This shows. <laughs> but this shows, this is like a strappy sandal. There's another name for this type of a sandal, too. This zips down the back also. But I'll take these things out. And that is the shoe, and it's uh, almost like a reptile print. Those are cute. They're by Reaction, Kenneth Cole, and they are size I should have my magnifying glass here. 
Um, I can't see the size, or I can't read it. It's I'm sure it's there. Let's see if it's the other one. This is the other one. There's more things inside. Let's see if I can see the size on this one. Well, it's got to be there, but I just can't see it well enough. Reaction by Kenneth Cole. Those are cute. There's a name for this type of a sandal. Reptile print and metallic. It's good now. Okay, gladiator. That's it. <laughs> you must read my mind. Yeah, gladiator. That's the word I was trying to think of. I'll open what was in there now. Hollister. Oh, that's cute. This is a cute little crop top. Floral. Semi-sheer. Really cute. Little uh, short sleeves. Yeah, size small by Hollister. Has a little peplum. Along this bottom. I look kind of drab white because I do not, this was a no makeup day. I just put a little lipstick on before we came on, but yeah. Also, I was walking around the yard and I picked some dandelions and some little uh, forget-me-nots. <clears throat> this is by a brand I've never heard of. S-H-E-L-N. Schlen. Schlen. No. I don't know. I'm not <laughs> I have no idea how to pronounce that. But it's all embroidered. This is pretty. I wonder if this is linen. Maybe. Maybe. Could be. Now, cotton and polyester it has sort of that linen y feel, though. It would be cool. It's a crop top, just a scoop neck. Pull over top. That's really pretty. <clears throat> Very summery. You, you fit these boxes together like a puzzle. Thirty-five items in here for two twenty each. That's really good. You do better than I can do shopping. This is by Truth NYC. Never had that brand here. Polka dots and ties at the waist. I think these are cute. That tie at the waist. Buttons down the front. It's turquoise and this uh, maroon or burgundy color. Semi sheer also. <clears throat> I sold a little top, polka dot top, a red polka dot top over there. But it's somebody, the, the person that bought it uh, made a... Uh, you know, a bid for it, not a bid, but you know, 
uh, offer, made an offer, but they offered the same price that was on it. So that's kind of strange. It was not very much at all. And uh, when I looked at who bought it, she has zero, she has zero uh, feedback. So it's either uh, something going on or I don't ever expect to get paid for it. Or she doesn't know what she's doing because she just started and did this by mistake. I have no idea. Somebody said if you get weird offers like that, uh, just delete it or something. So I'm just, I don't know. I'll just wait and see if anything happens. <clears throat> this is a uh, little racer back sort of top tank top in this paisley print pullover and this is by altered state in a small oh it in the back it's a crossover see it opens up i know what i'm telling you bumblebee <laughs> you know what this does it opens up here in the back <clears throat> another cute little crop, crop top I didn't find, did I drop the other one? No. I didn't find any good tops the last time. Like I said, they were all wintery tops. Oh, here's a pair of sandals, I think. Yes. Crocs. <laughs> Boy, my favorite. These are little uh, thong, thong sandals by Crocs in a women's seven and they're purple cool i did hit find a pair of crocs at uh the goodwill the last goodwill i went but they were in just horrendous shape so i didn't get them but yeah good Let me see here. I have to read this. Not sure how you say shine or shin either. I don't know either. It's a fast fa fast fashion, like Forever 21. But that particular top, I think, will sell well with the 3D embroider. White is big this season and a crop top. It is. That's that was that's a really cute top. This is by Banana Republic in a small, has a little peplum, elastic around the waist, covered buttons to the waist. It's a size, I said that's small. This feels linen-y too. <clears throat> Yes, 100% linen. Sometimes if I'm in a hurry or I'm tired and I don't want to finish doing, you know, much more in a Goodwill store, I'll just go along and feel the tops, feel them. Because I can usually pick out linen pretty good. Linen and silk, you can pretty much tell by the feel. Pretty color. Another white oh, Knox Rose, my favorite. <laughs> a little uh, boho top, cottage core, whatever you want to call it. Uh, high low hem, lots of embroidery, short sleeve, lots of white on this too, and this is large. That's really pretty. This is all embroidered along the hem, too. Very nice. <clears throat> I 
don't bumblebee don't forget to send me the invoice <laughs> and when i send the check back cash it i don't know how i still don't know if we ever figured out that last bunch or not okay this is talbot's petites in a medium A button up blouse, pretty stripe. I love Talbot's. Talbot's sell well for me. Did I say medium? Yeah. <clears throat> Another pair of shorts. These are by Massimo High Rise Short in a size 8. Perfect. All distressed. Chopped up. A kind that sells. Raw edges. Yeah, high rise also. Good. Get the ones loose. Spare pin. Bowden. Uh, in a six regular, in a US six regular. These are a pair of pants. Like khaki colored pants. Looked like it had elastic, but I don't think it does. Oh, and it has a uh, turned up hem, you know, with the button and the flap there where you can roll up the hem and make them into capris, like. Uh, nice. I haven't found a pair of bo any Bowden in a long time near me. <clears throat> Yeah, those are nice. What did I say these were? Six. A little small. You know, I had to go to a funeral a few days back on Monday. And it was my friend from the barn, Judy's husband, died. Not unexpected. And, uh, I had a terrible time finding something to wear. I don't have those kind of clothes anymore. It was a very laid back funeral, number one. I wouldn't have had to worry, but I did, I didn't know what, you know, I thought, you know, you'd wear regular clothes like you wear to church. So I finally found a pair of pants, almost like Chico's Travelers, those slinky type pants, comfy. Okay, not a problem. I found, and I found a top. I used, I, out, out of my inventory, I found a Finding shoes that fit me anymore was a problem. I had some that I had pulled from inventory a long time ago. They fit me a couple of years ago, but boy, were they uncomfortable. I could not wait to get home to get those shoes off. Yeah. I probably should look for shoes for myself when I go thrifting once in a while. Loft Plus. I don't think I've ever seen that. Loft Plus in a size 16. This is a pull. Is that a pullover? No, it's a wrap. This is a true wrap dress. Or not dress, top. This is a true wrap in a slate blue color. This feels silky. Let me look. It has a tie that goes around too and ties in the back. <clears throat> this is one of those 
fabrics. It could be rayon, could be polyester, but it feels like silk. It's 100% polyester. <laughs> I say the size. Yeah, 16. Good size. I filled up my steamer. I had to buy another jug of distilled water because my the water was getting really down. I didn't want to really use it anymore. So I had to go buy a couple bottles of distilled water to put in it because it holds a lot. That big steamer I have, that holds a lot of water. So I'm ready to steam. Uh, this is by... Frencha? I can barely read that. I've got to get to the uh, Frenchie, maybe. I've got to get to the eye, doctor. Oh, this is pretty. Very, very pretty. Extra small. The semi sheer white. And this is lace on the bodice. It's a beautiful top. Long sleeve. And this is polyester also. So yeah, beautiful. Beautiful top. Little top. <clears throat> Zebra, something zebra. The skirt and it's lined. It's energy golf. Good time for golf. Anything golf. It's energy by Chico's. It's a size zero, which is a medium, I believe, in Chico's. A cute little skirt. Is it shorts? Yeah, it's shorts with a skirt over it. That's a skirt. <laughs> yeah, there's white shorts underneath here. A full white shorts. So it's a golfing, kind of dressy golfing. It's sort of zebra inspired, I would say, wouldn't you? I don't know. It's pretty. It has pockets, of course. You need pockets if you're golfing. <laughs> oh, and it has a little leg pocket down here with a zipper, too. Maybe for your tees. See, I used to golf. <clears throat> Sheer is a good keyword these days. And of course, romantic. Oh, Diane's here. Hi, Diane. Chambray tops were. Oop, I missed it. Chambray tops were in Poshmark's trending the other day. Oh, good. Okay. Yeah, I always get those if I can find them. Thank you. Happy birthday to me. Yes, it was yesterday, the 4th. Yes, thank you. <clears throat> so far, we haven't got the get together to get, you know, yet. The, the kids, the kids track schedules are getting in the way. <clears throat> this is very, what is this? Ooh, could this be a little short dress? This is by Licorice. In a large, a large, what is this? It's stretchy, has sequins along the bottom. This is very fancy. 
lace and sequins. Is this the top? It must be the top. Lace straps. Very fancy. <clears throat> Black lace and sequins. Licorice. I think I've seen that uh, before. Licorice. It's all cotton. <clears throat> yes, zebra inspired. That's what you put in the invoice. Okay. I remember that, that you said zebra. It, what, when you said something is inspired, if it doesn't look exactly like it, but it sort of looks, yeah. <clears throat> I've used that before. This is by, this looks, looks like an anthropology tag. A apostrophe R E V E, Arive, Arive, and a medium. This is a little pull on, yeah, pull on skirt of elastic. And it has a lace overlay over black. A white uh, lace overlay. That's different. Is this a, is this Posh, a Poshmark brand? <clears throat> if, if this box wouldn't have come today, I didn't know when it was coming. I was planning on doing a walk around the yard today. I'll do that maybe tomorrow or maybe I want to do it while the trees are in bloom. My dogwood tree is in full bloom and my crab apple tree. It is. Okay. Oh, it is an anthro. Okay. Yeah, it looks like an anthro tag. <clears throat> Ann Taylor Loft in a six. A pretty little pullover top with the V neck. It's a semi sheer over a lining. And, oh, this is silk. Okay. 100% silk. Polyester lining. Very pretty. Rewind in a medium. This is a little dress. Oh, this is cute. It has uh, some braiding and some uh, crochet at the top. A little dress. Like a shift, I think. This is a shift dress. <clears throat> medium by Rewind. Sort of a, the black is sort of like a crepey type fabric. <clears throat> Where the tag is here. Um, I think it is rayon, all rayon. Cute for summer, and I think that's cool. That crepey ran. <clears throat> hey, this is soft, whatever it is. What is oh, it's a jacket, a pullover jacket. Eddie Bauer Golf, another golf. 
in a large. This is very soft. It has elastic around the waist and around the sleeves. I bet this is waterproof or water resistant. That's what it feels like. It has a lining. Is that a lining or the fabric? No, it's the fabric. Yeah, this is, has to be waterproof. <clears throat> if you could feel the inside of this, it's uh, polyester, but it's like coated on the inside. And there's the tag, Eddie Bauer Golf. Perfect. like a present for my birthday. <laughs> Cynthia Rowley. Cute. This is cute. Black with tiny little, are those flowers? Yeah, tiny little flowers. Little uh, sort of bell or ruffle, no, flared ruffly sleeve. And a ruffle around the bottom. That is cute in a small. Bumblebee, let me ask you this. When you go shopping for, for when you go thrifting, when you go through the racks of clothes, do you, are you looking at the name brand as, is that what you're looking at? Or do you ignore the name brand altogether and you're just looking at the clothes? I'm thinking you do that. I make this, and I've tried not to do this. I still go through and I'm just looking at the name brand. Sometimes I don't even see the clothes. I think that's my big mistake. Let me see here. You're saying something. The licorice is a top, sequins, lace, metallic, in posh drop-down menu. Can't think of what they call it. Okay. <clears throat> yes, rewind, crepe, gauzy, keywords. <clears throat> I love these black and white. I like black and white. In fact, the jacket I stole from inventory to wear to the funeral is black and white. <clears throat> and then it didn't really matter what I had on because it was pouring rain. I had to put a trench coat on over everything anyway. I spent the whole day trying to get that trying to get that outfit together and it really didn't matter. Mimi Chica. Mimi Chica. I think there's a Mama Chica. There's a Mama Chica on whatnot. Whatnot. She's been on there since the beginning. And she sells on there all the time. This is an extra small. has an elastic neckline like off the shoulder long sleeves and a ruffle top and it's cropped sort of an ivory color with black flowers that's cute You look at the price first, then brand and style. Hmm. Okay. Mm. 
I look I look for the half price tags, <laughs> but uh, I still look at if I have time. I'm looking, trying to look at everything, but I sort through fast, and I'm looking. I swear I'm only looking at the brands. I should just look at the whole style. Oh, I haven't had one of these in a while. Life is good. I like waves, it says. Very summery, little tank top. By life is good. And there's a little guy. This pretty green color. This is like never ending little box. Big box. These shorts are getting bigger as we go down. <laughs> this is time and true. High rise again in a size 16. These are new. This is new with tags, new with half a tag, <laughs> uh, 3.5, three and a half inch inseam. Time and true. That's what my sweatshirt is that I kept. I think it's a, I think it's Walmart or Target brand. I'm not sure which one of the two. I just sold a time and true something, a top. This is a Lauren, Ralph Lauren, non iron, 3X. Uh, this is a woman's buttons. Buttons to the left. This is a woman's. Uh, long sleeve shirt. You wouldn't think nowadays, the way things are in the workforce and everything, you wouldn't think that these shirts sell, but they do. I sell quite a bit of women's button up shirts. Somebody must still be dressing up to go to work. <laughs> uh, Ralph Lauren, my favorite brands. This saw uh, Dylan, extra large. Dylan. I don't know if I've ever had that or not. There's the tag. Dylan. This is a tunic pullover, pink, very soft top, little tunic top. Are you made out here so soft? Here it is. <clears throat> it's not going to tell me. You could be a nightshirt or you could be a tunic top. Take your pick. It's a high low uh, bottom. Something very floral. <laughs> it's just large and floral. It has to be like a cardigan top. Yeah. This is like a kimono top or a cardigan. I'm 
no, there's no, uh, yeah, there's a sleeve there. <laughs> this is just a, a long, like a, what do you call this? Oh, oh Dylan is part of Sundance. Okay. Would you call this like a kimono top? Oh. It's very soft too. A cardigan, cardigan top. That's a this, is, this for sure is a mannequin piece. <laughs> Umji kimono, yes. Oh, it's Umji. I didn't find the tag. <clears throat> okay, kimono. Oh, there it is. Umji, USA, medium, large. <clears throat> Pretty colors. Semi sheer. This is by Label B. Never heard of that either. Label. Label B. Label B. Label B. Doesn't have a size. Oh, this is another one of those things. <laughs> Another, uh, just a, this is beautiful colors. Another big kimono type uh, top. You could wear this over a swimsuit too. The beach. <clears throat> it's tropical print. This is Sonomo in a large, sort of boho, like a handkerchief print almost like. It has a uh, little tassel ties, looks like leather. I think these are leather. Uh, leather tassel ties. Three quarter sleeve. And elastic around the bottom. <laughs> oh my heavens, I see the bottom of the box. Okay, here's something denim. White stag. In a ladies' medium, eight to ten. This is oh, this is a jacket. Oh, that's pretty. This pretty embroidery, and it also has little uh, sparkly like beads on it. Little tiny glass beads, metal buttons. Little, uh, jacket jacket it has embroidery across the shoulders too <sighs> perfect for summer I'm going to uh, hang these all up, and since my steamer's down here on this floor, I'm just going to uh, leave them down here till I uh, use the steamer. This is by Solitaire in a 2X. Another white piece, 
sort of crepey type fabric. And a lot of embroidery. This is pretty. Embroidery around the hem, around the top bodice. And it buttons down the back with pearl, little pearl but a uh, shell buttons. These are like shell. <clears throat> shell buttons. This is very pretty. 2X. There's embroidery long, uh, yeah, not embroidery. Crochet, I'm trying to say. Crochet along the shoulders and down the sleeves and along the bottom. <clears throat> I think this may be the last piece. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, what do we have here? Avenue in a size 30, 32. Avenue is a plus lady size or brand. My daughter, when she was doing all those plus size clothes, she had several pieces of this Avenue. Uh, I don't know if this is a tunic or a little dress. I think it's most likely a tunic top in this lime green and it has slits rounded him uh, with sort of a slit up the side front pockets and there is the tag for Avenue yes 3032 sleeveless tunic top And that's sort of shell buttons, too. <clears throat> well, there you have it. This is a lot. A lot that came in this little box. Well, this big box. <sighs> oh, now I have an, a lot to, uh, a lot of things to list. I've done two of the caps so far from the last one i did all the shoes they're on i'm working through the uh, clothes there's several pieces i have to iron upstairs that would be best ironed instead of steamed and uh then i think i'll be almost done with that haul that i got those two hauls now i get to start on this one I think most of this stuff is going to be steamed. I think it looks like most would be best steamed. I should do a I should do a talking video while I'm steaming, like Lori was it not Lori Tat? Who does that? She lives out in the mountains in California. Uh, yeah, I watch her once in a while. She's a real estate lady, too. Okay. Thank you so much. Don't forget the invoice. <laughs> it's not in here, is it? I don't think so. I didn't see it. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. Common Tags, that's it. That's her name. Yeah, common tags. She does her steaming videos and puts a timer on. All right, I will uh, get these things hung up, let them hang out for a day or so, and then start my steaming process. It's supposed to be a really nice day out tomorrow uh, and the weekend. Hope I'm hoping my kids come out uh, this weekend, but I don't know. The kids have, there's track meets on both Saturday and Sunday, so I don't know if they're going to get out here or not. At least, at least my son should come out with one of them on Saturday. Oh, and on Saturday he has a golfing thing at his golf club. 
I don't know if I'll ever see him. That whole golfing thing's starting now. So, Sonia Wills. No, I do not sell on whatnot. I haven't been brave enough to do that. My, I'm old and I lose my words too often to be on something live for a big audience like that to try to sell anything. I'd be, I just, I thought about it. I also thought about doing Poshmark. They have a live one too. Uh, but no, I have never done it. Uh, yeah. I know now you can put, I think it's my, I don't know if it's both whatnot and Poshmark. You can just do silent ones where you're not talking at all. You're just showing uh, pieces of clothing. That would be more my speed. But I think people on whatnot, at least, I think people were following the personalities of the people more, you know. So I don't know. And the prices people get are much less than I can get selling it on eBay and Poshmark. So, yeah. Well, I have, like today, my words aren't so great. But on so, there's some days, I'm telling you, I sound like an idiot. <laughs> my words just won't come. They're hidden someplace in here. I don't know where they go. And there's other days I'm fine. It's just part of getting, you know, getting older. Uh, yeah. So I am going, thank you, Sonia, for stopping by. I'll uh, see you Sunday for sure for the, for the What's Old video. And then next week, maybe I'll do something in the middle of the week, either outside. Hopefully, it'll stay nice, and I can do an outside video. So thank you, Bumblebees. Thank you so much for this box. I know everything will sell of yours <laughs> sooner or later. And I will see you again Sunday.